I just wanted to show my my favorite rooster. This well, this line came from my dad. He gave me a rooster uh, some time back, and uh, so I bred him. And he, I got him. I got a stag out of him, and I bred him with a Kelso hand, and had four daughters. I kept four daughters, so I could line breed them. I was gonna breed them again so I could have a stag and breed them back to the back to the mom side, but the hen died on me. She uh, it was weird. One day she just woke up dead. I guess she didn't wake up at all. <laughs> but so I bred them to the daughter, and I have three pullets that I'm trying to breed back to the dad to him and I just had a question about the stag I kept the stag out of him and his daughter and I wanted to breed I wanted to breed that stag back to his mom and you know start working on them too for a while but I don't know how far I can go uh, I, I don't know if I'm gonna start seeing any negative side effects on that you know since it is technically his mom his mom slash sister so this there on this side okay here we go that's the, the grandson and that's the mom right next to him he has a little bit of scars on his head because when he was young he got pecked a lot so I had to separate him. I took him out, and I followed him till now. So that 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 was my question. I want to see how far I can go with this too. If anybody has any idea or tips on this, I really appreciate it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna show you his sisters, which I'm line breeding back to the pops. That's her, one of them. They're real smart chickens. And that's the other one. But I pick them up and they'll start talking to you. They're, they're really interesting. When you grab them, they'll look at you. You can see them tilting their head and they'll look at you right in the eyes. And start talking to you. <laughs> so, I don't know. There's some highly intelligent birds. Anyways, if you guys have any advice on what to do with the stag and, and the mom, I really appreciate it. Thank you.